state of Maine in the coastal area attracts a huge amount of people from all over the country. Not so much from Vermont and New Hampshire, but many from Texas, California, and so on. These people have all purchased furniture. We put this on our website, and we invite people to view it on our website. We don't invite people to specifically phone up and ask how they like their furniture. However, it wouldn't bother us if somebody did that, but we don't encourage it because we feel that's an infringement on people's privacy. We've only had about two people in the, in the 17 years we've been doing this uh, request that their name not be put on the list, which is pretty, pretty amazing. There's about 4,000 customers here. And they repeat, come back and buy two more chairs or buy their kids something. Uh, and we, we have, we, we, one of the problems is we don't know what to do with people who die, for example, and we hear about, and do we take them off the list? Or perhaps they got a divorce uh, and uh, he got the chairs and the table and uh, she got nothing or they split the item up. So we, got, we, we don't have any hard and fast rules about what to do with that. We, we joke about it periodically. It's fun. But people come here and they say, oh, I used to live in uh, Massachusetts or uh, Michigan. Uh, oh, look at here's a doctor so-and-so. While they may not know that person personally, they do know that, uh, uh, that we, we must be okay if we sold Dr. So-and-so in Franklin, Michigan. Or, what have you like that. It's just like a, a, a like having a cocktail party without the cocktails. <laughs> it's just, it's a, we, we have uh, so many people come in and, uh, and say hello and uh, uh, they, may, they may say right up front we you know, don't want to buy any furniture this year, don't have any need for anything, your table and chairs or the bed or whatever you made is doing fine, but we just were passing by and wanted to stop in and say hello. And I think that's amazing in this day and age that that, that rep rapport can exist between people uh, coming to the shop and just going down the road. I mean, to stop into a store and say hello to the people that own it, I think that's, that's wonderful. We have been successful in, uh, in, uh, uh, in what I endeavored to do. I, I'll never forget the time I had a had a guy come, uh, it was in the spring of the year, and he, we were walking from the workshop over to be, over here to the showroom, and the apple blossoms were all out on the trees. And he says, you got a nice place here, and they were all white on the ground, they really they'd fallen off the trees. And, and uh, he says, you got a nice place here, but you don't get very rich, meaning it was up here in those Timbuktu and Maine and so on, and I said, well, I reached down and I picked up a handful of these apple blossoms and I says, I got a few more of these than you got. And he says, no, no, I was talking about, I says, I know what you were talking about. <laughs> it just depends on what you're counting, the commodity you're counting. And, and uh, indeed, uh, I value these friends on this list, these people on this list as friends of mine. And, and in fact, we have people, we have a couple from Wisconsin, it brings us two jars of homemade jelly every year. We've had people make homemade Kahlua. The guy in uh, Princeton, New Jersey brings us something every year. And we've traveled around the world with the, the lawyer guy from the Boston area and his wife. And uh, we, 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 we go out to dinner with many of these people. And they come in and give me a big hug and a kiss. And whoever they are, it's, it's, it's like a social structure that our customers have become. And it's, uh, it's one of the reasons why I can't imagine retiring. I'm 61 years old and got a few health difficulties. And by some, some, some people would, would advise me to retire. But the, the, to lose the interaction that I have with all of our wonderful customers would be an extreme loss for me. It would be, I, and I can't imagine doing that.